I'm excited today because I get to play on the balance beam. Today we're talking a little bit more about my Olympic balance beam warm up. Now I've shown you some skills before, um, some kind of basic skills that you want to train every day. This is a few more of those skills that I always had as part of my balance beam warm up really since the time I was about nine years old. These are good drills for you to work on every single day before your beam practice starts. So one of my favorites of course is the sidekick. And the sidekick is important because it really helps you focus, think about the stability of the rest of your body. You can't be leaning out here or moving your hips over. You really want to make sure that the only thing that's moving is your leg. And of course you can kick out small to start with like this, or of course you can work your way all the way up as high as you can. No matter what, you want to keep your body stable. The next one is a pivot turn. This is, can be a really challenging one, but it's so important um, to every beam skill that you do. This really puts you in a position where you could easily fall off. So this is a great way to really think about that focus. I'm going to spot each end of the beam, so you'll watch my head for that, and I'm going to turn from my inner thighs. I'm going to squeeze my inner thighs in order to turn. I'm not using my shoulders, just my inner thighs. So you want to stay nice and crisp and clean on those turns. All right, so the next one is kind of fun, bunny hops. Um, just like they sound, you're going to do little bunny hops. Now these are not big jumps. We'll get to that in a minute. Just little bunny hops. And again, you're just working on punching up, making sure you, know, you kind of might get off a little bit here or there. It's really working on pulling your body back over the balance beam. So little short bunny hops all the way down the beam. You can also do those backwards on the way back. Next, we're going to do the big jump. So this is the nice high jump. You're trying to touch the ceiling. And you really want to point your toes off of the balance beam. So a big swing. <laughs> And really, when you land, you want to make sure that your knees are pointed over the balance beam and you're nice and stable. So those are the big jumps. And lastly today, we're going to do the hurdle. This is really important, especially if you have a hurdle for your beam dismount. Stretch up tall, focus, think about you're going to do a dismount or you're going to do a round off. And you really want to just focus on keeping all of your body parts right over the balance beam. These are great drills to work every single day. Do these, maybe five or ten of them, before you start on your beam workout. Thanks so much for tuning in today. And for even more gymnastics how-to videos, make sure that you hit subscribe. And if you want to keep up with everything Shannon Miller, make sure to follow me on all my social media channels.